hello guys welcome back to my channel hope everyone is doing fine we have a guest here today we have a guest here today Hi guys. and uh, i'll give her time to introduce herself but i am in bafoot we are in bafoot i came to lay my father-in-law to rest i i think i announced uh, his passing here to you all and um yeah my father-in-law passed on went to rest on the 5th of august and um i came and announced to you because if you have been on my channel you know the relationship i have with my father-in-law mm -hmm. and so i i told you guys that we were preparing to <clears throat> leave him to rest for the funeral we we're praying for the funeral and it happened on the 13th that was last friday it's exactly one week mm -hmm. since we we laid him to rest and um we are here just for more few days and we'll be out of Bafut. so i just think that i've been so busy but i always think of you guys like i said in one of my videos that good friends check on each other i, I no matter how busy it gets i still think of you guys and today i brought my my younger sister here i know you guys are not meeting her for the first time she has, she was here in 2022 Mm -hmm. She was here in 2022. You yeah, have forgotten. <laughs> you, were here, you were on this channel in 2022. It's been it's been some it's been a while, and um, she's here again today. And um, I'll just give her the floor to introduce herself, and then we get to the topic of today. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you so much, um, guys. I'm really happy to be with you all once again. Yeah, it's been a while, and I'm not really versed with this though. But as a supportive sister, I know <laughs> I always have to show some love for the fans. You I know. know she really cares about you all, though. So my name is Emelda Are. I'm a nurse, mm -hmm. and nice yeah, name. we are in Bafu. As you can see, the father-in-law is right here, uh -huh. still in our hearts, guys. That's why mm -hmm. I am still putting on this t-shirt. Yeah. So today we have something very beautiful for you all, and just stay tuned and listen to the very end the best is at the end of it you know right yeah 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 so guys i i just want to like we were just having a, a talk we we're having a conversation inside and i yeah. said okay this is a topic that will help so many of us and for us to just keep it to ourselves and be talking let's come with it here so that you can also it can be of help to you you can benefit yeah. you can pick one or two things from it and yeah that is why we are here and we are talking about marriage i know very well that Marriage is that one topic that will never go old. Marriage is that one topic that will keep coming up on the internet because it was ordained by God. Yeah. And um, it's not as easy as it sounds. And that is why we keep bringing up this topic so that with the little knowledge that we have, with the little experience that I've had, and um, I can be of help to you. Mm. And yeah. So today I just want us to talk about why why are most people let me say why are men that's my observation why why is it that yeah women are some also men unique. why is that some men are afraid to get married are scared to get married you see a man who is very well to do you you, you meet a man who has a good job who, are, who is established who has a house who has just everything going well and the only thing that is not there is a wife to compliment everything and you ask them they, they will be like oh they have not met the right person oh they have... we we're talking about it today and i'm like okay let's bring it here and i have we are just going to discuss like it's it's, it's a normal we are just in right yeah we are just in a gist and um yeah. this is my younger sister she's not married yet and i like having this kind of conversations with her because it's it's like um an eye opener it, it gives her a lot of things like it helps her learn a lot mm -hmm. you see that's why i chose to have this because she will have some questions to ask me of course i'm very open to answer i always answer them each time they bring those questions one thing i want to say is that i have discovered that the majority of men who are ripe for marriage who are yet not married don't even recognize don't realize that what is happening to them is fear Mm -hmm. Let me say that again. Let me say that again. <laughs> it's like, it's like let, me, let me go. Yes, we are back after the small short break. Yeah, so I want to ask her. It looks like you're behind. Can you please sit properly? Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Okay. So I want to ask her 
what are some of the reasons what are some of the, those things that make you uh, fear or what are some of the fears you have when you think about marriage what, what, what are your fears what scares um, you about marriage yeah this is a kind of reality question and sometimes you cannot actually run away from questions like this mm -hmm. no matter how long you stay but you have to face the fact mm -hmm. and yes i sometimes a girl i was really really afraid of of relationship entirely as a whole i was really scared of it and not because i am not able to get into a relationship you understand but because sometimes i feel like there is too much responsibility in me that i am not ready to commit sometimes i feel like being in a relationship is like you're sharing your life with somebody mm -hmm. and as well as, get, as getting married and in the relationship in a home is, is different it's right mm. yeah so it's like you getting into it you have to let people know you have to let the, your partner know okay i'm not going to do this and i have to go to this place i have to it's like you're explaining your entire life to somebody like you really have to report everything about you to somebody and sometimes it's just really boring and it's crazy and that's my fear that's my biggest that's fear. your biggest fear yeah and sometimes even if you start explaining yourself to me it was not just about me it was about my partner too and if the partner start explaining everything about him to me sometimes i get bored and i'm like i don't want to hear about that i don't need it in fact i'm tired just let me be <laughs> yeah so sometimes it's like oh oh my really god quiet they just want to really yeah i just want to be me i just want to be quiet i just want to be now me. now what i want to say just is me. she's talking as a single like she's not married yet and um, i want to say that get it clearly despite the fact that she has her fears it stands that she is going to get married someday yeah she will definitely get married someday and um, I want to say that I understand I kind of understand her fears but it's not a school